I can't reiterate this enough guys, but $299 may seem like a lot of money up front, but for a portable VR gaming console that's really competent, I was very, I've been very surprised for, you know, doing my three weeks with this thing, how good it is and how fun and how engaging and also how good the performance is in terms of power and battery and everything. So for 299 bucks, and if you're able to catch some sales that I've seen similar to Cyber Monday and Black Friday, this thing will go down even further. I saw like on Amazon, it was like $100 store credit or something like that, which is amazing. By the way, when you buy this, it comes with the controller as well as a free game, the Batman Arkham Shadow. Um, and it's a really decently long game and it's really, really good, really fun. And it's like $40 on the store itself. So, you know, you get a $40 deal right there. But anyways, this thing, if you're not familiar with it, it's basically um, a light version of the Quest 3. So you have the same hardware for the most part, like the processor, the Snapdragon XR2 Gen 2 um, that runs graphics and everything and processing. It's in here. Um, it has sli slightly lower storage, but it's still enough for most games and most users. I haven't run out of space at all, not even close, even with recording and all that. The processor is powerful. I'll tell you what, the only time it bogs down is if you're doing simultaneous playing games and recording with the mic, which I've done before. Uh, you will see it starting to start to stutter uh, in the first place. But other than that, it's solid. Now, the only other difference too, the big one, if you come from the three, you will notice that the Fresnel lens versus pancake lens, that's a huge difference as well as resolution. And I would say the resolution 1080p is sufficient for most of the apps available on the store and even helps with battery life compared to the three. This adds about 20, 30 minutes on top of the other model in real life. Um, this might look different to you because I've upgraded the head strap, but the core unit itself is fantastic and it's really where it's at. I just added this strap that helps a little bit more with comfort and battery life. There's a battery at the back here that doubles battery life. Just with the core unit, you're getting around like two hours, you know, in real life, but doing this adds another two hours. So that's really, really nice there. And, um, I got this for, I think, less than 20 bucks on Cyber Monday, which was fantastic. Um, I also love the uh, the uh, Touch Plus controllers. These things are really sensitive and have great battery life. So in the last few weeks, I've used this every single day. And right now it's sitting at 80% battery, which is nice. It's replaceable in here. I think it's double A or yeah, double A batteries per side, so which is nice. Um, but otherwise, I'm lo loving this. So, you know, if you like to work out, it, this is not going to replace like some are some are some companies are pushing this. Even Meta does uh, pushing this as a virtual workspace, you know, but like a Vis Apple Vision Pro or something. No, not even close, but it does a little bit here and there. You know, you can br browse the web, check your Facebook, do WhatsApp calls with this. But it's really about the experience. You know, you can watch videos, play games, and just get to get, you know, go to the Meta Horizon where you can just mix around with friends and just join different worlds and such. Um, but one of the biggest things for me, and I think for most users, is the workout. I, I would say this is like a modern day, better version of the Wii. Like if you like to work out and such, this thing is fantastic. I just get a sweat. I can get a good cardio with this, just with boxing or even Batman. I, I'm like fighting my way through the crowds and such. It's really a workout, especially as the weather weather has changed. Um, as it got, it's gotten colder, this is a great way to work out if you can't go out. But anyways, yeah, 299 bucks. Go check it out right now. The links are down below. Um, and let me know if you have one yourself and you know, it'd be awesome to see how what you think about it.